Matt Wieters gearing up for Game 3, trying to salvage the last game of the series as the team heads to Boston. Matt has done a great job of calling the games uh, with the young pitchers, especially yesterday we saw with Mitch Atkins. But this Rangers lineup, one of the best hitting in the American League, and he spoke about facing this lineup. They're a good hitting team. There's no question about that with their guys in the lineup. So, you know, the big thing is, is is just sort of, you know, staying down and then changing eye levels to where they just can't sit on certain pitches or certain locations. And, and you know, last night we got a great start and we were able to, to get through six innings. And, and it was just a, a matter of mixing it up on these guys because if you let them uh, guess the right pitch, then they're going to, you know, have a good chance to hit it. You did a real good job last night calling the game for Mitch Atkins, and you mentioned mixing it up. He pitched backwards most of the night, and as a result of that, he was very effective. Oh, it, was, it was huge, you know, and he was he was a guy who made uh, adjustments on the fly. You know, he'd have a pitch that, that, you know, wasn't quite in the location we wanted, and he would correct it the next pitch, and, you know, that's, that's, that's huge. When you can throw a pitch and just make an adjustment off of it and, you know, throw a better one the next pitch, it's, it's huge, and it makes it even tougher to hit. I was pretty impressed that even though he did give up a lot of hits, they were all singles, and he had that ability to get out of the inning against a, a big-hitting team like this. That's so important. Oh, it's huge. When you can leave guys out there on the bases, you know, they're going to get their hits. And, you know, they have hitters in the lineup who are going to get their hits. But to be able to spread them out and, you know, keep us with the lead, you know, deep in the ball game is all you can ask for out of your starter. Now, tonight you have the most experienced starter on the staff going in Jeremy Guthrie. How will you work with him to get that mixing up of the pitches to be effective for him? I guess always good at that. He's always good at uh, he, He's good at watching film and coming in with a game plan of what he wants to do. And he, he knows... Uh, you know what he needs to do against these hitters and knows that uh, you know he can't just sit one speed on these guys so he'll always be a guy who can throw any pitch in any count and you know that should give us a good chance tonight. Now hitter friendly ballpark I've noticed a little bit of spring in your step since the Orioles got here you seem to enjoy it in this place. It's uh yeah it's a good park to hit in you know if uh, you hit a ball good it's got a good chance to, to carry out but uh you know, it's uh, you know we play in a lot of parks that are just neat to play in. And last year, unfortunately, you know, got hurt here and to get to play here, so it's uh, you know good to, to get to play some games here. A three-game series here. Ron Washington shows you for the All-Star team. He'll be your manager. Have you had a chance to talk to him here? And what do you think that's going to be like in Phoenix, where you're playing for a different manager, even though it's just for a night? I haven't talked to him yet. You know, we'll hope to tell him thank you today uh, sometime. But uh, no, it's it, it'll be. I think it'll be a fun experience just playing with different guys and. And uh, hopefully we'll be able to get a win tonight so he can't hold over a, a sweep over my head when, when we're there. Yeah, that's going to be, uh, I would imagine when you first walk into that locker room with all the stars, because there are huge names on this team, and you're certainly uh, well-deserving of it, but that's got to be a huge thrill. Oh, it is. I, I, you know, you get to play against, you know, a lot of the great players in the game, and to be able to be on the same team and same field with a lot of those guys, it's a huge honor, and, uh, you know, I'm excited about it.